People across the world in 800 cities are celebrating Make Music Day. In tonight's Zevely Zone, Jeff's in Carlsbad pulling some strings at the Museum of Making Music. You're listening to the world's largest harp. It's good for the heart, man, for sure. Every time William Close plays it, he stares back at people staring at him in a state of wonder. Especially this instrument really touches into people's emotions. William grew up on sailboats and took his love of rigging to gigging. He invented his earth harp in 2001 and shares this sound with people all over the planet. I think he's fantastic. We're so lucky to have him here in Carlsbad. I mean, he's been all over the world. We well, don't think that strings running, what, 50, 60, almost 100 feet across the parking lot would sound so beautiful. B.J. Morgan from the Museum of Making Music encourages children of all ages to make music. Some are even playing the harp for the very first time before heading outside to see this. As impressive as this setup is, it pales in comparison to the day William strung a harp across a canyon. And don't get me started on that night in Singapore. Stretching strings from the ground to the top of a skyscraper. The first string took two hours to run. The Guinness Book of World Records named the Earth Harp the longest stringed instrument in the world. I made the record. <laughs> now, William makes music for the ages. I think it's awesome. For people of all ages. I'm overwhelmed. Which strikes a chord with people like Bill Laird. Do you have tears in your eyes? Yes. <laughs> How come? It just gives me goosebumps. I do, I get a lot of criers. It's fun, it's a lot of fun. I mean, it's my job to go around the world playing a giant harp, you know, <laughs> somebody's gotta do it. In the Zevely Zone, Jeff Zevely, CBS News 8. Such a calming power that the harp has. It, it, music affects all of us. If it doesn't affect, I, it affects me anyway. It's, Even just listening to that just it, now, it's like, It does. Ah. If you would like to support the Museum of Making Music, they'd love for you to come to the San Diego Bluegrass Concert on August 25th. For more information, click on the hot button at CBS8.com.